Hello and welcome to Layers of Fear 2. This game should be played in normal mode or maybe the safe mode just to I don't know, just to copy the feeling of the first game where we had literally only one possibility to die apparently here. It's gonna be a norm. Such a shame. You almost had it. <laughs> the unmooring. This time we'll have to manually charge the audiobooks. Hope you settled in alright. Remember what we talked about. Focus on what you do best. Go to that special place of yours. Find your motivation. Build the character. Trust me, I'll, it will be worth it. I'll keep, try to keep in touch. Travel safe. Your friend and agent. Some um, friendly. Build the character. Connect the memories, dreams, and fears. Prepare for the big role. Act. Oh, there's something else. So long I have struggled to finish what I started. I had nearly lost hope. And yet, here we are. Hmm, let's visit the upper floor first. will find on the way will appear here. Esteemed traveler, the room has been set up as per your request. The real was delivered shortly before departure. We wish you a fulfilling journey. Respectfully, Icarus, Transatlantic. Build the character. Preparation. Explore who am I? Where am I? One in his time plays the parts of many men. He observes the others, while the others watch him. He's expected to behave properly, wandering through worlds that aren't really there. 
he puts on masks and adjusts accordingly. Each mask is a character, each character a layer. Layers upon layers calling out to him. He must build the character he was meant to portray or lose himself completely. Submerged, tightly surrounded by lives he's never lived. And yet, he stands on a stage where every man must play a part. And his is a sad one. Act one, then more. Yeah, I guess this is just a loading screen, so I, I promise I won't be reading that anymore. I promise. Um, I'm sorry, but I think we've gotten the wrong door. Uh, esteemed traveler, as per the director's request, this section of the ship has been closed off to all passengers and crew. We wish you a pleasant and fulfilling day. Thank you. But that means we cannot go. <laughs> I guess. Can we see it again? Hmm. Can we play? Unfortunately. Not this time. Oh, actually, I think it can be. Listen, okay. once you get there, just do what you have to do. Get to the set and build this character for him. That's all that matters. If you say so. If you think so. But is it really all that matters? There's nothing interesting here. Oh! Yeah, yeah, I know you've told me a million times how much you hate the sea. And I'm telling you, this gig is just too good to pass up. To the edge of the world and back again. Uh, I think you should change your agent. You, you have some problems with communication. Passengers this way, please. Did you check the lower decks this time? 
I swear to God, if we find any stowaways again, you'll never set foot on a ship again. Oh my. We're still on the same... I think the weather is getting worse. In an unprecedented move, the director decided to shoot his next motion picture aboard an ocean liner traveling across the Atlantic. Plot details are kept under wraps, but our trusted sources claim that the project has found its star I an obvious choice, perhaps, given the star's fabled career and numerous critically acclaimed roles. It seems that the recent worrying rumors as to the artist's personal life has not dissuaded the director. Hmm. Um, may I ask why are you really going? through someone's personal belongings? No, just asking. It's a little bit weird because I have to pull the mouse my way if I want to open the door by pushing it. It's weird. From security office to chief security officer. The new procedures come into force as of next week. The company holds you personally responsible for enforcing them. Prepare all of the cards for detailed briefings. As you are well aware, there have been prior incidents of unwanted individuals making their way aboard the vessel. We must ensure that does not happen again. In short, stowaways will not be tolerated. Hmm? Hmm. Oh, a key. Oh, I could use one of those fans today. Hmm. It's been so scorching lately. Never met the guy in person, but few people have. That's why you hear all these rumors about him being broken or disfigured, all that nonsense. About who? Hi, little one. Are you okay? Everything's closed around here. Dash 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 dot 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 dash dash oh is that not an SOS? sure it is because SOS was designed in such way to be easy to remember
Oh, what do we have here? A performance for the ages. Acting, if done well, is a scary business. It takes immense courage to lose consciousness of your own self and not just reenact, but become the character you are portraying. Few can master that kind of courage. And yet, it happens. To which, after last night's visit to the Majestic Theatre, I can personally attest. As my regular readers know all too well, I am careful with words and not the easiest critic to please. Having said that, the play's lead performance left me speechless. Utterly fearless, the acting by unintelligible name was nothing short of transcendent. It was as if the person on stage dissolved before my very eyes, letting the character burst into existence. And apparently this person had some problems getting up. This I will never understand. That's one of the few British things I will never, ever understand. Something... 11. Okay. Hmm? I thought I saw someone there. And what's only natural? I wanted to place them. Dear fellow traveller, I apologize for being forward, but when I would heard we were to travel on the same ship, I could not resist the temptation. Just think of me as an admirer of your talent, your performances. They speak to me like no other have ever. To say that you are my favorite actor would be a gross understatement. I do wish we could meet in person. Still, if you could grace this modest piece of paper with your signature, I would treasure it more than anything. In any case, I remain forever your greatest admirer. Mm -hmm. Can we by any chance visit the kitchen? Unfortunately, no. He's got a reputation. Makes his actors jump through hoops before he even lets them on the set. Supposed to be some new method of building the character. Bunch of artsy fartsy bullshit if you ask me. Just go with it. Guy doesn't take no for an answer. Sounds like someone we've met. This is a break. So what if the guy's a little nuts? He's a director. He comes with a job. I mean, what's he gonna do? Kill ya? Maybe. It's all an act. You think? And no, it broke. Mm -hmm. From Icarus Transland Atlantic Security Office to all officers. 
Most of you are already aware of the Hollywood motion picture that is going to be shot aboard our vessel. We are sending you detailed guidelines as to which decks are to be restricted for regular passengers. Above all else, the film crew and cast are not to be disturbed. So this is why there is no one here. Is it? There's always a way. A light in the darkness. There's always a way. Do you remember? I don't think so. Sorry. Before the world told you who you should be. Do you remember who you were? Come. I will make you remember. Okay. So many have tried to be a part of my greatest work. As if there was ever a choice. Only one can bring this character to life. Only one is broken enough to build it. Hi. I believe in you. Thank you. Wake up, Mr. Hardy. We've got to get out of this godforsaken prison before we rot. Oh no. We saw something with 11, so I thought it would be worth a try. I saw something, but that wasn't the case. Hmm. Is there any? Ooh, we can use maybe two sails, three pirates, and two bones, or hmm. I cannot move the room. I see four here, I think. Maybe three here. Definitely too much of the race. Hmm. Are you sure there's nothing over here? Hmm.
and this is definitely locked. Hmm. I think I'll end this part here. So for now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon.